Hello, how is everybody today? Two more unboxings to go. Stall Standard and High Volt are prizes they have been given away. Yep, that means I'm going to have to find a High Volt in the wild. But that's how it goes. Let's open Dive Collapse. Along with Fiesta, check my last video. I talk about him. The normal version, we unboxed him. Dive Collapse was probably my second most anticipated of this first and second wave. Thank you to Activision for sending me the whole lot that's out here before you. Happy to get it, happy to play the game. The game has been a lot of fun already. Gosh darn it. I completely forgot to do this. I want to get eyebrow. I want to get eyebrow. But I forgot him. He's in another room. I'm not walking over there. It's just not gonna happen. There's a sticker. Dive Clops is the twin brother of eyebrow. How do I know that? I watched one of Wisdom's video, and it is in the collector's guide, the, I don't know what you want to call it, the Skyliner Superchargers book guide, whatever you want to call it, in his bio, he is indeed the brother, not the cousin, some people want to say cousin, but he is the twin brother, so that's a cool tie-in. I think he's the only sibling combo. Him and Eyebrow are the only sibling combo in Skylanders. Let's talk about a mundane detail on this figure first. If you didn't notice, the... Let's get another water. The bases, although they're both water, are completely different. Not gonna spend a ton of time, but see how it goes up right here. In this one, looks like kind of he pounded down and the water went away from it. See? Whew. And did you care about that? I'm sorry if you didn't. This guy's looking fierce. He's just a giant eyeball, pretty much. And I'm not sure. Yeah, I can touch his eyeball. I'm not sure how when he's underwater. This mask is going to protect him. He should have a... Hey, we'll get Dive Bomb right here. He should have a protective cover. They should have gone away with the mask. The mask is okay. If they took away that mask and put a cover, like a... I don't know what you want to call it. You know what I'm talking about. The normal portholes, whatever you want to call them. He would have been much better protected underwater. I think it would have actually looked better. A little better. He would have seen his eyeball better. Better, better, better. You tell me. I haven't heard anyone mention that. I just thought of it. I think it would look better with a clear porthole cover, glass kind of thing, than this mask. It's just not doing anything. I'm telling you, it's not doing anything. Look. Poke you in the eye. Look. I know. I'm playing with toys now. See? He's dead. They did absolutely nothing. The detail, though, is very good. If you look on the back, you see the dent? Looks like the pressure from the water has taken a toll on this mask. So that's cool. It's the details. You have to look. So it has a worn underwater look to it. And that's about it. Pretty, other than that, he's a pretty plain guy, but he looks really good. And he's a heavy guy. From the B-roll stuff Activision sent, he looked really good in game. I'm looking forward to playing him. Like I said, he was an early favorite. We're going to take a quick look at 
the poster after we unbox Smash Hit. And then probably sometime next week, after I play these last few, I will tell you, excuse me, I had to clear my throat. I'll tell you some of my surprises, who I like, who I don't like, disappointments, all kinds of good stuff for you next week. It's going to be a ton of Skylanders. You probably won't see much else for a while, quite honestly. <laughs> Just because it's a great game and I'm having lots of fun racing online with other people. Doing the co-op. I mean, there's just so much to do. I'm done. Audios.